What's up people of YouTube, I'm Karsatowski and welcome back to the Karsatowski Games YouTube channel. So as you can tell, I am back here in bowling and I'm also back in Wii Sports Bowling. Now in Wii Sports Resort Bowling, for whatever reason, the Wii Motion Plus will only allow me to hook the ball like a left-handed bowler or to just do a backup ball. So I've decided that, you know what, in order to get good, really good at a backup ball, I think I'm going to practice a lot in Wii Sports. So today, I am going to go pro in Wii Sports Bowling using a backup ball. Now, I eventually want to be able to bowl a perfect game, but I'm not quite good enough at it to be able to do that now. So by going pro, by doing a backup ball, it will help me to be able to get a perfect game one of these days. And yeah, I just can't hook the ball like a left-hander that much, especially with doing a backup ball. Yeah, the ball just is not hooking as much. So I might have to move a little bit further right. And that was, that was absolutely high in the pocket. Now, a lot of my spares I'll pick up as a right-hander and as a left-hander also. But I pretty much had no choice in Wii Sports Resort because it would only let me hook the ball a certain way. And as of right now, I think right over first arrow to the left side is probably the best way to go about this, I would say. It's a pretty consistent line, I would give it that. I might end up moving a little bit left like I was doing in Wii Sports Resort. What I've noticed in this game is the ball doesn't... Oh, that's a pretty good break for Turkey. So what I've noticed in this game is that the ball doesn't necessarily seem to hook as much in Wii Sports as it does in Wii Sports Resort. I guess just in the tropical area, the lanes are a little bit drier, which I guess it makes sense because it's hotter in those areas, but I don't even know where Wii Sports takes place. But it doesn't take place in the tropics, though. <coughs> Alright, so far so good. I'm getting lined up here. Right around that first air on the left side and throwing it pretty hard and straight seems to be the best angle to go. And that's actually a very similar angle that I take with going on the right side. Nice. So I would say that's probably what I'm going to do here. And it's pretty consistent. Like, I can tell when I loft it a little bit like I did on that shot and when I pull it and when I miss it left and all kinds of stuff like that and just throw it weak. But overall, nice. that's a really good spot to throw it because it keeps you... It keeps your angles relatively tight. So you can do the same thing continuously and it will leave a similar result. So that is a 232 game. And with my first game doing a backup ball, that's not half bad. I probably could have put my me character as left-handed, but I decided against it. Oh, tripped out the 710. I'm gonna hook at this one. Okay, I haven't left anything too crazy as of yet. Having a little trouble with the corner pins, though. But having no trouble picking them up. Now that's a pretty good shot right there. That's about the best shot I've thrown all day. We go another quality shot. That time it left the six pin. I'm used to leaving the six pin when the ball goes a touch high as a right hander. Okay, that was a tad bit light. I moved a little bit too much. Oh, come on. Barely missed it. It's my first open frame. I'm not leaving any splits, which is a good sign. If you're throwing good shots and not leaving a bunch of splits, then you're in a good part of the lane. And you're throwing it pretty good too. Nice. 
That's pretty good high flush. Nice Yeah, I should have moved slightly off that one based on how high the last one was. Nice spare. Oh, now that actually would have picked up the seven pin. That, as a matter of fact, probably would have picked up the six, seven, ten. Nice throw. Oh, yeah. That's going to be a common pin for me to leave, for sure. Nice spare. 205. Not a particularly high gain, but, you know, we're making progress. Averaging 200 going a backup ball is pretty decent. Ooh, I almost left a big four that time. Ooh, I, I could have missed that one pretty easy. So that one had a lot of side rotation on that ball. And that was extremely slow. I don't even know why I threw that slow. Okay, there we go. Powerful strike. Come on. It's my first split that I've left. Okay. I had the right speed on it. I just did not have the right rotation at all. Nice throw. Okay, let's go. Let's keep nice it going. Throw. Let's go, let's go. Oh my gosh, it's a fast eight. Much better nice pickup. All nice right, here we go. Push, push, thank you. Nice. Oh, trip out that nine pin. There we go. Thank you. There we go. That's a hand bone. I think that's my first or second hand bone of the day. Oh, now that was a very messy hit. Look at that leave. Well, at least we got over 200. We got a 210. I want to shoot like a 250 and a 260. That's really what I need to start shooting. I'm getting it a little bit fast, and it's just getting a little bit light in the pocket. Yeah, it's getting pretty light in the pocket now. Oh, that, that was actually pretty close. Yeah, it's got to go a little bit more like that. I would prefer a little bit more axis tilt to make sure the ball finishes more flush in the pocket, similar to that one. Yeah, that was extremely high. Yep. I'm going to be leaving that pin as probably the single pin the most. I really have not left many seven pins, though. But I've left a lot of those four pins. But I've left, left a lot of those six pins, rather.
Okay, pretty good nice. shot. Oh, I lofted the crap out of that one. Nice okay, perfect shot. Nice Oh, I know that's a pretty interesting break. Oh, another freaking fast eight. Come on. Nice spare. <sighs> well, two, 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 twenty two. We need about two more games to get to pro status. Uh, a little light. Crap, I did it again. That's the second time I've done that. Ooh, left another six pin. Nice spare. Left another dadgum six pin. Okay, now, yeah, that cut it super duper close. Uh, man, three consecutive six pins. Who would have thought? Well, nice it's actually there. no surprise, because I did say that's probably going to end up being my most leap single pin. So that tells me that I probably should move a little nice. bit. And that shot was great shot, great result. Okay. Well, I mean, I honestly wouldn't have done anything different on that shot. Just an, an unfortunate break. Okay. That was a little bit left, and it was just... Didn't have as much hook on it. Nice spare. <coughs> There we go. Nice I've noticed a lot of my strikes bowling like this are a lot messier than bowling right-handed the right way. Nice like that one right there. Now, that trip double wood out. That was a great mix-up. Push. Come on. No help on the nine pin? Really? Okay, I can only shoot 195, so my first sub 200 game, but it, it's still not a half bad game, 195. Okay, let's have a couple more really good games here, shall we? Oh, really? I'm going to try to hook at this one. Oh my gosh. Now, that was literally like half a board from getting that. That was super close. Okay. Back to back splits. Well, now let's go for 710. I have picked this up before on the channel, by the way. Oh! Again, that was probably about a board from possibly picking that up. Okay, so back-to-back -back splits to start off, followed by a pretty flush strike. That was yanked. That was yanked to high heaven, and we got ourselves three splits. Huh. Now, that was super slow. If I would have been further right than that, that would have had a chance, but... As is, that was pretty pathetic. Oh, pick up the 7-pin. 
Yeah, I'm having a little trouble with carry right now. And I just, I didn't even try for that one. I'm gonna try what I do in Wii Sports Resort and go a little bit inside and see if that works. And so far that shot seems to look pretty good. Push, push, oh my gosh. Yeah, you can have a relatively low miss area for that part of the lane too. So I honestly don't really like that angle for this game. It's fine for Wii Sports Resort, but for Wii Sports, I just per much prefer to do that angle nice hard and straight. I think the hard and straight angle is probably the best angle to play for this game. Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? I have had such bad pin carry nice this whole game, and I only have two strikes to show for it. Okay, there we go. Good grief. 149. That you you're not gonna see me shoot scores that low very often. Okay, well, let's get back into it, I suppose. Start off with the great looking strike. Start off with a double strike. Okay, now that one just didn't have very much hook to it. That's close. Oh, oh my goodness. That's just about as close as you can get to it without picking it up. Man. Okay. As long as we follow it up with strikes, we're in good position. Here we go. Now that's probably the best looking strike I've had all day. Just look at that. That is picture perfect. Yeah, I don't know what happened last game, but this game is the polar opposite of last game was, pretty much. Who I did not throw very good that time. Nice spare. Okay, that's a pretty good shot. Nice throw. Mm, yeah, that was a six pin the whole way. I aimed to... I didn't nice go far spare. enough left. I mean, that's not a terrible angle, but for this game, I would much prefer to go hard and straight. That's just the best way to go about it. Okay, I'm going to bowl one more game, and I will be a pro. So let's get on with it. Back-to-back -back solid nine pins. Nice spare. Mm. I may have dreams about that dadgum six pin. Push. Nice spare. Nice throw. Nice 
pretty good. All right, I'll take that one. Nice All right, good break. Push. Stupid dadgum six pins. Okay, that was pitiful. Yeah, I I did not have very much hook on that shot at all. And that's actually a pretty tough spare. Whether you're right or left-handed. Or backup ball. Okay, that was yanked. That had a lot of loft on it. Okay, finish off with not that great of a game at 201. The second lowest of the day, but I'll take it. I mean... So it's going to take me a while to be able to bowl a perfect game with a backup ball, but I feel like I'm getting pretty good at it. I just went a little bit too fast there towards the end. So if I just keep practicing at it, I should be able to bowl a perfect game pretty soon. And if you all would like to see me bowl a perfect game, throwing a backup ball, then be sure you hit that subscribe button so you'll never miss any of my videos. I'm Kar Satowski. Keep watching my content and I'll see you in that next video. See ya.